Good morning guys, uh, welcome to Real Talk. So today is an exciting day, so it's Saturday, the, uh, I think it's the 1st of April actually. Uh, we're taking delivery on the new BMW M140i, which is exciting, it's about 8 o'clock in the morning at the moment. Uh, weather doesn't look too great, but hopefully it will hold out, because obviously we're going to want to put foot down a bit, and uh, it is a real wheel drive car. Uh, there's also some sad news as well because we're saying goodbye to the E46 M3. So this is my first kind of vlog, uh, so bear with me, but I just thought I'd document the experience of uh, taking delivery of a new car because obviously some people are interested. Every delivery, every handover is different, so um, keep you updated let's see how it goes so we're uh, in the M3 uh, just about to leave to make our way to BMW Halliwell Jones uh, this is going to be the new proud owner of do you want to say BMW M140i so you excited so excited oh mate I'm fucking excited so I don't know how you're feeling oh righty let's get going Halliwell Jones and the car doesn't seem to be outside which is uh, good we don't want to ruin the surprise but we're outside BMW Halliwell Jones to pick up the M140 I uh, can't see it outside anywhere yeah hopefully the weather just holds out but we'll see feeling excited into Halliwell Jones oh look there's a Alpina there excellent That's an Alpina Lex. That's decent. Nice spec as well. It's quite good. They're quick. Look at the fat cans, Lex. Nice M2. I'm keeping on the camera, Lex. Like. Dad probably get it. Right, so we're just about to do the paperwork. Most boring part of any handover, but uh, I'll try and capture some of that, and then obviously it's seeing the car. Not a cheap sign, mate, yeah. It's a weird pen. Right. 
Yeah, so you press it forward for Sport, press it forward twice for Sport Plus. Obviously Sport Plus is the same as Sport, but we, we will turn the traction control off as well. Okay, so, so if you've got balls legs, should do that. And then Eco Pro, obviously I explained inside what how that works, but obviously as soon as you lift off it will go into coast mode. Right, right first drive in the uh, 140. Okay, we'd have to turn this down so we can hear the noise. Put it in fucking sport, mate. How does it feel? It feels absolutely... It feels really light. Because it's, it's a lot smaller, so you've come out of an M3, similar power, and now you've jumped into this. Now obviously you don't know what the power's like, you've got to put your foot down, but... Speed transmission. Brakes are unbelievable then as well. Yeah, brakes feel good. Yeah. It just feels so madness. I'll put that a bit here. You're you just, no, because I've got a car right in front of me. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know. Don't worry. I'm just getting a feel for it because you can't expect me to just floor it the moment I've got in it. I want to get a feel. You know, just like the steering, the response, everything. Like it just feels so smooth and you can't hear anything outside. No, it feels, it, it's well insulated, you know, and considering how much was this? 35 lifts with the extras, with the must M carbon exhaust. And you look at the competitors with the A45 AMG, which is 10 grand more. The RS3, 10 grand more. I don't think, I don't think they're 10 grand. I test drove the, not the A45, but the CLA A45, and there weren't that much of a difference. Well, we'll see how it adds up. You've test, you've test driven the A45, so obviously you've not put your foot down yet. But we'll find out pretty soon. Brakes are really responsive, man. Right, flick it into sports. See if you notice a difference. You should, you should feel the difference. You notice a difference. It's got a lot louder. Straight away, straight away it's got louder and everything is just responding a lot quicker like the accelerator you can feel straight away when I'm, I'm tapping it now. Yeah, it sounds a lot louder. And it notice it holds onto gears a lot longer yeah. as well. Yeah. Everything I've got. So what else did you did you get then? Talk us through so what foldable mirrors. Yep. Carbon fibre exhaust, um, LED lights with the high beam assist, uh, Harman Kardon sound system, yep. reverse camera sensors, um, and that's yeah, the M carbon exhaust. So good, good extras then, and then the red leather interior and the Alpine white, which sets it off nicely. <coughs> I think the sound system was something that was needed as well. Yeah? Yeah. But it's just everything, it's got, it's comfortable, you feel like you're in a, like a posh car, but then you put, I didn't even put my foot down there, but you can feel the car is just waiting to go. I'm looking forward to actually giving it some. And the A45, like, it's a great race car, but it looks like a race car. This does both. You know, you could go to a business meeting and you wouldn't look out of place in this, but then you could kick half the car's asses if you needed to. Well. Exactly. Fuck me! <laughs> 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 you sh <laughs> You shat yourself oh, there! Fucking hell! <laughs> <laughs> I'd love to see that! <laughs> I'd love to see that reaction! Mate, that was unbelievable! So you grabbed the steering wheel! That was so a madness! Oh, I got all fucking red! <laughs> Yeah, so this definitely is a, a wolf in sheepskin. Because a lot of people wouldn't know what kind of car this is until you put your foot down, especially if you have it debadged. Obviously the two exhausts at the back, the alloys and the wind mirrors, because they're um, they're brushed aluminium, yeah. gives it away. But from behind, really and truly, you wouldn't know. No. And this is a, a fast car. It's, that so, was unbelievable. I did not expect that. Six 
one. I just did not expect that. I thought, I put my foot down for a second, thought this is a bit slow, and then, then it happened. Please turn left in 200 yards. That's not even funny. Just, just look at this. Rev, rev it, just fucking rev it. <laughs> fucking hell, that was quick. I didn't expect that. I shat my pants. Right, jump. So we just got the car home now. Sounds amazing, uh, good experience, and it is it is quick. So uh, it's going to be plenty of videos following this one. Uh, just about the car, you know, some fun things, drifting maybe. I don't know, but um, stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching.